Take a trip through the Lost Library and discover what's available now from yours truly. When their parents are taken captive by a wicked necromancer and his sinister crocodile men, a pack of children from the peaceful land of Aquania must journey across their continent, meeting strange beings and confronting untold terrors in their quest to rescue their families from a witch queen eager to raise a demon lord from his fiery abode. The Young Barbarians, written by your boy Crypto, is available now in both digital and print form on Amazon.com. Published by the fine folks at the Lost Library. And support your boy Crypto by picking up a copy today. Link in the description below. Hello all you beautiful people in Webtown and welcome back to Crypto Comics. It is time for another journey into the Ultraverse. This is Prototype. And today we're going to cover issues 2 through 4. And if I'm going to be honest, you know, uh, felt almost as uneventful as freaks and that's uh that's too bad you know he's fighting robots right and what's kind of interesting about this uh this whole series is that it's really about two prototypes it's about the new prototype who's a young kid and it's about the older prototype who is much more interesting than the young kid hey relax kid it was just virtual reality oh the neuro freaking transmitters what a load of crap oh my head where's hastings Where's Hastings? Oh man, my head hurts so bad. I still haven't healed up from that fight with Prime, which we checked out in uh, Prime issue number four. You can check the, the back issue bins here at Crypto Comics and uh, find the Prime reviews of issue number one and then the subsequent issues leading up to the breakthrough. Did the other guy get headaches like this, Hastings? He occasionally complained of discomfort after overindulging the night before, but that was rare. You mean the implants and the drugs didn't bug him at all? Mr. Campbell used only external equipment. He did not have neural net implants, and he refused the enhancement treatments. No aminos? No steroids? What did he do to stay in shape? I, I believe he did it the old-fashioned way. He worked out. When did he have the time? If I'm not training, I'm working with my acting coach or shooting commercials. I barely get to sleep. I'm sure there's a medication for that as well, sir. I'll ask. It's that brain stuff that does it. I know they improve my reaction time. But they make me real sketchy. I'm buzzing all the time. I'm sure your recent trauma hasn't helped the situation. Hastings, I don't care what the cops say. I swear I didn't smoke that guy. I couldn't have. That's all from Prime, issue number one. This gig was supposed to be my ticket out of the burrito, Hastings. A dream job with a big salary and security for my family. See, he's Hispanic, but he's got the blue eyes. This is really, really exactly what you expect from, uh, from the entertainment industry in Los Angeles circa 1993, 1994, 1991. Uh, blood in, blood out, right? Blood in, blood out. If you haven't seen that movie, worth a watch. That's uh, one of those lost direct-to-video epics. I don't know how else to describe it. It's like the godfather of LA street gang movies, but sort of whitewashed because they put the, the white kid in there with the blue eyes, but he's trying so hard to be part of the gang. Watch it, blood in, blood out. Oh, I need a massage, that blonde with the big hands. Wow, what? I don't, I don't understand. With the big hands, huh? Some uh, unusual things going on there. Uh, you know, they're all just pining over what's going on with this prototype and you know, he's been embarrassing us and we need to get better. What about the other prototype? We can't let anyone know that there's another prototype. Prototype 2000? That's not scheduled for release until the year 2000. For the public record, it is our future. My future. Jimmy and Bob Campbell before him are just temporary until we get prototype 2000 completed. Of course, you know. And of course, she's hired an assassin to kill Bob Campbell. And Bob Campbell gets, you know, followed. And he's trying to buy some, uh, some, I guess, what you call like illegal prosthetic parts for himself, you know? Because he's the original prototype, but then they fired him. But then he's still going to try to be prototype. It's interesting. It's an interesting part, but it's just, uh, I don't know. I wish they'd focus on that a lot more, you know, than the, the teenage kid. He's, uh, he, gets up, he gets to hog way too much of the book. And then there's this, this chick, right? And don't mess with her, and she's got the sharp nails, and those are gonna come into play. We got a Lady Deathstrike vibe coming up here. 
And she, of course, hits on Bob Campbell. Oh, I'd love to take you home. Let's go back to your house. Oh, what's this? Oh, it's for a, a, a directed low budget feature, direct to video that I'm uh, working on, a little sci fi thing for a friend. And now let's, uh, let's do it. Oh, I've always wanted to do this to a woman. She's a lot heavier than she looks. Look at her. She's like six foot three. She's, I think she's a man. The one with the big hands and the Adam's apple. Send her in. Yep, see those claws? Slash. The finest guitarist of all time. Come back to me, lover. Come back to backstabber. It won't hurt for very long. Trust me. Who the hell? What the hell are you? You're not human. That's for damn sure. Yeah, and they're gonna fight and throw the knives. His prosthetic arm gets caught. Oh, but luckily it's prosthetic, right? So you can just take it off and now they're gonna fight. But then his cat, Thelma, jumps in. No, you're gonna not. You're not gonna attack my master. Cat fight, cat fight, cat fight. And he's like running away and her claws grow even longer and she gets the really weird face like she's the Joker. I don't know. And then he's got his suit on. I don't know who you are, lady. I don't even know what you are. But Bob Campbell isn't going to take this line down. I just love a man in uniform. This assignment has been getting better with each passing minute. Let's fight. Da -da 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 -da. Let's fight. Da -da 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 -da. And he's like, no, check it out. I got a new shipment from the Wu-Tang Clan. Bzz, bust her arm. Bzz. So yeah, takes her out, right? I love it. It doesn't even take her out. Just cuts off her. Just cuts off her nails. How about that, right? Pretty beauty nail salon run by Bob Campbell. And then this is Bob Campbell's ex-wife, and she's on the phone with Stanley, who she's been having a bit of an affair with, um, and he wants her to come back to work at Ultratech, but she's not interested. And she's also not interested in just an occasional weekend fling. She's looking for a relationship. Oh my God, what's happening? Bob, what happened to you? Hi, honey. I'm home. Menace of Terrodyne, coming up next. Nightman, justice isn't always blind. We have checked out the Nightman issue number one. Nightman battled a tranny Leatherface. It was awesome. You can check it out in the back issue bins here at Crypto Comics. And we're just going to keep moving on to prototype number three, because that's what y'all came here for today, was a little, bit of a, a little bit of prototype, a little bit of Malibu, a little bit of the Ultraverse. Hero and the Terror. You're only a hero when it's in the best interest of Ultratech, Jimmy. You know the rules. Yeah, but that doesn't mean I have to like it. All right, game's over, boys. Nobody move, and some of you might live. We claim this plane in the name of Terrodyne Incorporated. Oh, and happy Halloween. Holy my God. This is, how did they get on the plane? With all that. I don't, I don't know. And it's just Terror Incorporated was like a Marvel thing. Terror Dine Incorporated? Come on. It's just, it's just the Terminator mixed with Terror Incorporated from Marvel. I don't get it. You don't have to shoot us, pal. We'll cooperate. We're on our way to the World Series. Precisely. And who wouldn't pay to have their championship team back in time to win all that advertising money? Marge Johnson, team owner. She'd pay you all right, but then deduct it from our salaries next year. Well, that's hardly Teradyne's problem, is it, Buzzy? You know me? Who doesn't? Buzzy West. Lifetime 362 hitter, averaging 48 bangers per season. But sat out most of this season with a shoulder injury. Why don't you take it easy next season, too? Kablam! Oh, my shoulder! Something's up over on the plane, Rangers. In Chicago. What do you say, Doc? We could sure use a hand here. It would be just like old times. It's tempting, but I'll have to pass. They found me again, and it's time to move on. Leave me alone, damn it! Haven't you done enough? Zet, 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 zet. Meanwhile, back in New York, a situation of a very different type is about to unfold. Quite a specimen, isn't he, boys? What's the verdict? Meter readings show glare has definite implants, Mr. Alexander. He's a wet wearer, all right. Okay, let's wrap it up and get him out of here. The guys back at Aladdin are going to want to go the full nine innings with this guy. Let's see, the prototype number one. You got you to check that out before you watch this video, if you haven't already. What do you think you're doing, Jimmy Ruiz? I'm a hero, Hastings, or so the press says. How do you think it would look to the media if a hostage situation turned ugly and everyone found out that Prototype was there and did nothing? Leland wouldn't like that at all. I gotta go. Here I go. No, you can't. You can't leave. Look, I have a special remote control. It activates a governor on your armor, shutting down your power grid. You're powerless until I get the go-ahead from Leland. Haha, <laughs> you mean this? 
You guys must have forgotten something. I'm a bored teenager with a lot of time on my hands. I take this thing apart like some guys work on cars. I'll know every inch of this hardware before I'm 21. Count on that. Give Leland my regards. <sighs> Bob Campbell was never like this. And speaking of Bob Campbell, here's the flashback to cutting off the claws on Backstabber. Oh, whoops. And then this is like a total Daredevil on Netflix scene where she's stitching up Bob, and he's injured and trying to get back together with her, but you know, I don't know, I can't, you don't need, you need more than a wife, Bob Campbell. You need more than a doctor. You need a lawyer and a psychiatrist and a bodyguard. Got any sisters? <laughs> Are they also busy dating the corporate monarchs over Ultratech? Oh, low blow, Mr. Bitter. Still a bit sensitive, are we? Some wounds never heal, especially when your wife leaves you for your boss. Remember, we both came here from LA for jobs with Ultratech. You were here for a research position, and I took the job as prototype. While well, I attended air shows and supermarket openings around the country, Leland was free to work his charms on you back in New York. Bob's gone as far as a man with his limitations can, Felicia. I can take you further faster. Bob's just a glorified stuntman. He's holding you back. All my life I played by the rules, Felicia. And look where it's taken me. Beaten, battered, divorced, broke, and alone. I'd gladly give up my other arm for a second chance. <gasps> Meanwhile, back with the young prototype, I'm here for a fight. Oh yeah, I'm gonna fight you. Hey, you're my favorite baseball player. Hey, can I get an autograph? Sure you can. Ha <laughs> ha, it's Heater, he showed up. Heat, 700 degrees Celsius. It's made out of Napalm Triple X, mixture unknown. And they fight, right? And they fight, and then they fight. Yeah, and then they fight. And then he saves Hastings. Hey, I got you Hastings. You know, you could stand to lose a few pounds. Don't worry about me. They've killed the pilot and are getting away with some of Ultratech's most sensitive equipment. Don't worry, Hastings. We still have... What? Gone? Damn. This has not been my day. I've had just about enough. I do not like to lose. crack a -coom. That's the little brother of crack a -doom. Okay, okay. Here we go. Here we go. If you don't know the crack of doom, you gotta go back, watch some of those Savage Dragon videos in the back issue bins. What? First Pinnacle Pictures and now this? Oh man, prototypes making us look terrible. I hate to look terrible. I hate bad news. Psh, let me throw you through a window. Any messages, Mrs. Phipps? Are you glad we skipped all that? All of the pieces are in place, my friend. Excellent, you've done well. Your money will be in the usual place. Click. The chip has been placed on the prototype suit. Soon, the chip will be mapping the suit, absorbing the algorithms, revealing the secrets of its power. All we have to do is retrieve the chip. And that's where you come in, Wrath. Stick close to Prototype. Watch him. See where he goes, what he does. And when the time comes, bring back that microchip. I think you already know how. It would be an honor, Mr. Alexander. I've been concerned about this Prototype since I saw him on the news. Next, Wrath, coming up in Prototype. Oh, we got some hard case. Oh, there's Diane, the lovely Diane. Discuss her at length. But wait, there's more. See, there's, oh, look at that. It's some more rune. This is, uh, this is number F. This is like issue zero. I'm confident this is gonna end up being issue zero and I'll mix that and we'll get to this. I, I, don't, I, don't, want, I don't want you to see too much there. It's a secret. Here we go, here we go. This is Nightman, right? This is all that matters is he's jumping down, finds these bad guys. I feel it, the evil. You're the one in danger. Ginger. Pricey Lee is not gonna take that. I mean, Nightman is not gonna take that. In your dreams. In your dreams. But if I can't take you two burglars, I can't take a cold-blooded killer. I did it. I really am the Nightman. I am <laughs> the Risey Man on sale now. Okay, so prototype three out of the way. Prototype four, enter Wrath. Coming up right now on Crypto Comics. Terminator 2, a sneak peek of what's to come. The heavy metal eye opener arrives in December for Genesis, Super Nintendo, and Game Gear from Acclaim. Okay, here's Jimmy. Uh, Jimmy, where'd you go? I used to live down there, in the streets, hanging with my amigos. It wasn't pretty, but at least I knew who to trust. Now, who knows? I'm out here, baby, just taking in the moonlight. You notice the theme in all of these 
Malibu books we've been covering with the moon. Oh yeah, it's gonna become more and more clear as time goes by. And then this is his, this is like his ex. This is his baby mama. And that's Rath. And she's, you know, she's looking for Jimmy, but oh no, there's no Jimmy here, ma'am. And then this guy sneaks in. It turns out it's Rath, what? And he's coming for the prototype. Once I get our little microchip recorder off the prototype body armor, it won't matter. Aladdin will have everything at once from Ultratech. What a piece of work. Reminds me of a Ferrari. Good thing the driver isn't around. Now, where's that chip? Got it. Come on, little dingus. Don't make me dig this beauty too deep. I appreciate American workmanship too much. Ah, uh, Jimmy, what's wrong? Are you having another nightmare? I'll call security, get a doctor or something. My new implant uh, feels like somebody's stabbing me. Uh, they said it would improve the body armor interface. Prevent my reoccurring offline problem in emergencies. Uh, uh, that's it. Someone's screwing with my armor. What kind of schlock outfit is this? Can't even get the security desk to answer. Forget it. I'll take care of it. Hey, who are you? Oh, a boy in his underwear. Maybe I was wrong about security around here. You'll never lay a hand on me, kid. But I'll make you a deal. I'm going to shove those words right down your what? Stay out of my way and you won't get hurt. Kid, huh? I'll show you who's a... What is it with this guy? I know I'm stronger and faster than most anybody. The scientist told me so. Some sort of genetic jump start. You know, you got some natural talent, kid. Pretty quick for an amateur. And you've had some training, too. Good, but you're still an amateur. Uh, good night, son. Clud. Robocop 3 was a crappy movie. I can't imagine the video game being much better. Take my advice, kid. Forget you ever saw me. My suit, maybe I can still, let me put it on. Ah, I can feel the painkillers pumping in. Now it's my turn. I'll take the prototype express. Going up. Psh, psh, psh. I wonder what that kid was doing hanging around the lab in his underwear. Go figure. Now all I have to do is walk out of here before the tranquilizer gas wears off and meet the copter. What the prototype? But I just, how did I run into you, machine man, when I saw your armor downstairs? Keep talking, smart guy. My targeting computer is up and running. When I saw your armor downstairs, I figured you were out for the evening. You want me? You got me. And I've got you in my sights. I must have dozed off or something. I gotta get some help. This is Security Station 1. We've got a Code 3 incident. And alert Mr. Leland, the prototype is involved. No, Steve. You did the right thing. I'll take care of it. Deep, deep. Hello, Al? Leland here. I hate to bother you this late, but I got some big action here at Ultratech. My boy Prototype has caught an intruder here at the office, and he's pounding on him in the lobby. Can you send over a news team right away? Thanks. It's about time I got some decent press. And they're gonna fight. And they're gonna fight. They're gonna pow. They're gonna wham. Pow and crash through this fight. You won't find a toy like this in any Cracker Jack box. Hey, let's keep fighting. I think we will. Flam, flam, flam. That was a good workout prototype, but my right is here. And I've got to get this memory chip back to my people. You can call me Wrath, and I'm one of the good guys. Oh, yeah, I believe that. You aren't going anywhere. Whoa, Angela, my ex-girlfriend. What's she doing here? Your power blast can't stop me, prototype. You'll just get them back. And more so. I need to end this now and get out of here. I wish I could tap into the source of his power and shut it down. He's killing me with my own weapons, and she's in the line of fire. Angela, quick, get behind me. Uh, see what I mean? Oh, you saved me. You saved my life, prototype. But, but, I'm out of here. Me, me, me. Ha, caught it. Ha, <laughs> ha, I'm flying away. Oh, look, there's that moon. There's that moon again. Damn, he got it back. All I can do is hope the microwave scrambled the information on that chip. Here, this ought to smother the flames. Let me go. I've got to talk to Jimmy. Listen, Missy, no one could talk to my boy right now. Here's a hundred bucks. Now pretend you aren't here. I don't want your damn money. I want my boyfriend, Jimmy. It's him. I know it's him. Under that mask is Jimmy Ruiz, my baby's father. What? He's got a kid that he's abandoned? Ah, oh, there's a regular Scott Summers. He's the South Central LA Scott Summers abandoning his child to become a superhero. Meanwhile, elsewhere, 
Bob Campbell rocks it in a giant robotic suit. I finally got all the pieces put together and all of the weaponry active, except for the blockbuster. But I couldn't test it here anyway. The neighbors are already suspicious about what I'm doing. Not as quiet as the old suit, and I won't be able to fly as high or as far, but I should be able to get off the ground with this gear. Damn, that's loud. I'm gonna wake the neighbors. I can explain away some of this as a movie stunt I'm preparing, but it's not common knowledge that I'm the original prototype. Thump, way too heavy. Got to readjust those gyros later. Now, let's give the weapon system a little workout. Multi-weapon anti-personal rubber bullets, armor-piercing shells, explosive missiles, bam, 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 bam! Pop, 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 crack. Jackhammer arm, oh, I love it. Servo strength enhancement of 15.2 times human. Hold it right there, Bob Campbell. Holy shh, you're under arrest for last night's burglary of Ultratech and assault with deadly intent. You have the right to remain silent or dead. Clack, 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 clack. And when we come in, you're going to hear this. Mm. Oh, there we go. Look at that. Bust a few heads. Eat, sleep, bust a few heads. Sunsoft's World Heroes for Super Nintendo. Because losing sucks. Got to get that power bad. Okay, so there we go. We got prototype two. Three and four for your viewing pleasure here on Crypto Comics. Just another of many journeys deep into the Ultraverse as we continue this deep dive exploration of all things Malibu Comics. Building our way toward Breakthrough, the first major crossover event in Ultraverse history. All that and more coming up here at Crypto Comics. Now, if you're looking for more adventure, more action, more excitement, more thrills, chills, and spills, check out my book. No, not comic book. Yes, real, regular book that you can read. It's called The Young Barbarians. It's an amazing, fantastical, magical, enchanted fantasy story featuring a group of kids who have to save their parents from a very, very wicked necromancer and an evil witch queen. Available on Amazon.com in digital and print form as part of the Lost Library, a collection of fantastic writers from the Western states of America looking to create the best original content for you, woke free. Check it out. And as always, thank you for watching Crypto Comics. I'll see you next time.